Oh my god. I'm gonna lose my sanity. You've been sitting here making oatmeal for like five hours and you're just now saying that you think <laughs> that you are going to lose your mind. It's Vanessa and welcome back to my channel. It's been a big second since I've done like a cooking video, a baking video, whatever. The last one I did was my baked oatmeal video, which you guys loved for some reason. I don't know why, but I love oatmeal and I'm glad you guys apparently like oatmeal too. We're gonna do another oat inspired video, but instead of trying thousands of baked oatmeals, we are gonna do oat recipes, but like not oatmeal. That would be boring. Went to Target with my friend Kenneth who needed to pick up prescriptions that he just didn't order in general, so he carried my eggs for me instead, which is really sweet. Anyways, I have 10 oat recipes. Recipes, everything, will be down in the description box. Credits to all the owners. Let's get started. Kinda wanna play music in the background. I know I'm gonna get copyrighted, but also, I'm just in a tea swifty mood. Can also do some Ed Sheeran. If you've been keeping up to date with me on like my private Instagram, you know I have a big thing for Ed Sheeran. Nathan even gave me a pass. Let's just get started with the first oat recipe because I'm gonna be here for probably eight hours. Let's go. First recipe is the raw oats, exotic oats. And I was talking to Ashley about this the other day and I was like, I don't understand why anyone would eat raw oats. And she looks at me, she goes, you're not gonna like what I have to say next. I cut this recipe in half, so in the description box, just double everything. First things first, wash your hands. If you guys don't believe me on how big of an oatmeal queen I am, I literally have this spoon called my oatmeal spoon. And I eat oatmeal every single day with it. I'm not even kidding, I eat oatmeal every single day. I wanna bring you guys closer. We don't care for all those extra ingredients right now. You just care to see me. Just kidding, we don't really care about me. We just care about what I'm doing. Fourth a cup of oats, half a spoonful of peanut butter. This is my favorite. Favorite peanut butter. I inhale this shiz. It calls for honey, but I just can't have honey. I'm a vegetarian and it's like my personal preference, so we're gonna use syrup. It doesn't say how much, so drizzle, 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 drizzle. Almond milk to desired consistency. My setup is so nice right now, guys. You can see the oven chilling behind me, you can see the fridge chilling next to me, you can see my oats chilling beside me. I'm just gonna go as like I think. We've come across it to be like this consistency. Taste test time. This is the exotic oats. I promise this video will get more entertaining. We just start off with the most boring one so you guys can get like a nice build up, you know? It's not bad. I will admit, I had super low expectations for it. It's not like heinous, but it's not like phenomenal. I just prefer my oats cooked. I have the most fire protein oatmeal recipe. So I'm gonna give this like a three out of 10. Also, I will not be wasting any food in this video. Good thing I live in IV and it's just a plethora, I'm not kidding, an endless supply of college students who would love free food. Next, we're gonna do avocado donuts. We're gonna grab our blender and a knife. This is dangerous, me with a knife. Half of an avocado, I picked out a really nice ripe one. When I was picking the avocados, I was super picky and Kenneth is like, why? Was that one like not good enough? And I was like, I don't know. This other one was just really speaking to me. Let's peel the avocado. It's like that video. That just unlocked a memory in my brain where it's that woman and she's like, peel the avocado. Peel the avocado. I'm like violating this avocado right now. Heat your oven to 350 degrees if you're following along with me. Two tablespoons of cocoa powder. Third a cup of maple syrup. Pinch of salt. Blend this baby together. Oh, I just dropped it on my phone. That's so sad. The amount of times I've dropped my phone in the toilet is a little sad. I once dropped it in the frat bathroom and I didn't notice. And then Ashley was like, dude, you just dropped your phone in there. And I was like, are you sure? You just gotta get all these freaking chunks out. I'm gonna need to put this into a bowl. Oh! This looks very promising, I'm not gonna lie. So it said 120 grams of oats. A half a cup dry is 140, so we just need a cup and a half. Look at that, I'm using my brain. Oh, okay, I forgot that that was in there. One and a half cup of oats, and now we need to blitz it into a flour. I like the way they say blitz, it literally is just blending it, but like blitz sounds way more intense. Look, it's blitzed now, a teaspoon of baking powder. This is a fourth of a teaspoon, so I guess we gotta put four of these. We literally just moved in, like not really, we moved in like a week ago, but we've been so lazy to like get this place together. We'll get on it sooner or later. Now we need to mix this up. I should have gotten a bigger bowl, but it's okay. We learned from our mistakes. This is looking pretty correct. It's like a flowery consistency, you know? I'm just gonna add a little bit of maple syrup to make it a little bit more, um, what's the word I'm thinking of? Viscous? There we go. That was nice. That was necessary. Make it a little more, like, bendable. What's that word? Bendable, stretchable, malleable, malleable. We're gonna, 
I was about to literally say we're gonna spray it with Pam and just pour maple syrup over them. I spray it with some non-stick, roll them into mini donut shapes. They look like little poops. It's too malleable. I made it too malleable. Oh, also, guess what? So last night was karaoke night at this place called Rockfire. Ashley and I decided, let's go sing. So we sang before he cheats in front of people. And it was the most fun I've had in my entire life. This is your sign to go sing before he cheats at your college town on their karaoke night. I realized I just suck at making donuts. I don't have a calling for this. There we go. These are what your donuts shouldn't look like because I'm awful at it. So just be a better donut roller than me. Pour some powdered sugar into this bowl. When I picked this powdered sugar, Kenneth was like, really that one? The other one was speaking to me more. And I was like, well, Kenneth, good thing this is my video and I picked this one. Just kidding. Kenneth, if you're watching, I respect your opinion on powdered sugars. When Ashley comes back from wherever the heck she went, she will also be taste testing. I don't know how trustworthy my opinion is. Like I literally eat oatmeal every single day because I think it's the best tasting thing on this planet. This is what they currently look like. If these on powdered sugar, so it looks like the donuts, donuts, whatever the heck. You know in time out, the ones we used to eat when we were really young that my mom would never let me eat because she said they were unhealthy. Oh, this one is broken here. Rest in peace, fallen soldier. Oh, this one's breaking as well. Rest in peace too, you fallen soldier. This is my best one. This is, oh, it just broke. Okay, rest in peace too, you fallen soldier. Here are my donuts. Let's do a taste test. The first initial bite is like pretty good, but then it's the chewiest thing of my entire life. And then it's too like cocoa powdery. I would have added some sugar to like mask that. With more powdered sugar, it's kind of fire. I think I just like the taste of powdered sugar. That is so chewy. Then again, I keep eating it, so it must be pretty good. I give it like a four out of 10. This is recipe number three, cake pop oats. Shout out Trace Oats for this. Half a cup of oats into flour. Do you guys like our 99 cent college bowls from Target? It's a classic. One teaspoon of baking powder. One, two, three, four. One tablespoon of maple syrup. Two tablespoons of yogurt. This is Height Hill protein yogurt. One scoop of cake pop protein powder. Unfortunately, I don't have that, but I did just drop literally 40 bucks on protein powder yesterday. It's the Orgain organic protein powder in vanilla. I literally put this in everything I eat. One scoop. Part of a cup of milk. Mix this and microwave it for 90 seconds. Time to post an Instagram story of this because this just looks awful right now. It looks like a cake. I think I accidentally made oat cake. Uh... Oh wait, no, it's supposed to be, oh okay, it's supposed to be cake pops. I am such a silly girl. Crumple it up. Oh guys, look at this. Add a spoonful of yogurt into this. Mix it up. Now we're gonna let this cool. Next on this agenda is the oat cake. Blend two cups of oats. We're gonna need to blitz this baby. It's like a walnut raisin oat cake, except I don't, oh gosh, I suck. Except I don't like raisins, so I'm omitting the raisins. Bone's not opening. It's oated out right now. Fourth a cup of nuts, a teaspoon of salt. I'm just gonna do a dash. Last time I measured everything out, I'm you guys were like, who measures stuff like that? I never do, actually, but I felt like you guys would have liked the accuracy, and instead I just got flamed for not measuring with my heart. A teaspoon of this baking powder. Two eggs. Two tablespoons of maple syrup. Ah! Hey! Fourth of a cup of your chosen milk. We're just mixing everything up right now. That was really good. What do you rate it? A solid eight out of ten. I like it a lot. Okay. What is this? Cookies? No, it's a donut. <laughs> what do you rate it? Like a two. This is just oh, not a big enough know. cake pan. Oh, you know what you could have done? Pull it out and then just like scrape it out of this. Ashley is a genius. Do this quick transfer. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Now we're putting them in the oven for 25 minutes. I'll help you. I'm okay. excited. Do you want to wash this? For the frosting, we're gonna do a couple large spoonfuls of yogurt. Dude, stop hashing on my recipes. Half a scoop of protein powder, two teaspoons of jam. It's official. We need a mop. We have a broom now. I did bring it to my old house. I didn't steal that. Also, stole back my lamp from my old house. It's all the Brita. Oh yeah, we need. We do need to give that back. I feel like it'd be good if it was like chocolate protein powder. Do you want to make your own? Fold it into a ball, and now you just coat. Why does it look like this? Cause... <laughs> Add more yogurt, I don't know. My camera started dying, so do you see my extension cord set up? <laughs> Off the cake pops, back in the fridge. Thinly sliced like that. Oh, I can do that. You're gonna make me eat a fucking red apple? Are you crazy? Dude, red apples are green apples. 
I will fight Ashley on this until the day I die. Like, when I get buried, all I'm gonna have everyone say is red apples are better. I also bought vanilla extract. It was time we got so that. So did I! I told you that yesterday! I bought it yesterday, bro. When did you tell me that yesterday? I literally told you yesterday. I don't I recall. That. I know exactly what you're gonna pull out right now. <laughs> a long time ago, I bought these for our Taco Tuesdays. They're little umbrellas. So we're gonna basically decompose the umbrella. Why would you decompose the umbrella when you can You wanna just, just- When you can have it okay. be an umbrella, that's just extra fun and festive. Here is our cake pop. A chocolate one that I concocted. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> This is fire, bro. Oh my god. I would eat this every day. Easy 10 out of 10. Like, BMS. Yeah, they're on the raw oat level. No, don't <laughs> you dare insult these. She's a beauty. Guys, I kind of popped off, I'm not gonna lie. You should intern for apple slicers next. No. Yeah. <laughs> People need to intern for you for apple slicing next. Look at this. No. Now let's slice into this baby. Or should we just raw fork it? No. Slice it. It's a cake, bro. So? <laughs> uh, where are our forks? <laughs> Do we have any clean forks? <laughs> Definitely not. I'm cutting a cake the way Shiv cuts a cake. <laughs> Shiv cuts his birthday cake. Oh my god. Slice by slice. Like he's never heard of the whole like that just doesn't exist. He and goes, I cut this on like every single he's of my like, birthday. This is how I cut cake. Oh my god, have you done that for 18 of your other Are birthdays? You like and no one has mentioned that that was an issue. Look at this. There's only two spoons in this house. <laughs> we only need two spoons. We don't have people to invite over right now. Hear that guys? We're lonely. We have no friends. <laughs> yes. Ah! Right, cheers. cheers. Oh, <laughs> The cake is a little dry. Weirdly, I kind of like the cake. But you know what it like? It's Milk. Four chocolate chips. I give it like a four. I always like this better than the cake pops, honestly. What? Okay, recipe number five. Cinnamon roll oat bars. I'm a whore for cinnamon. A cup and a third of oats. Let's this into a flour. If you don't know, I also- Oh wait, I already mentioned Ed Sheeran. Oh this video. my god. Why? Like, okay. <laughs> Oh, no. in your bowl. <laughs> I'm bringing in my Eddie Million Dollar cook-off skills here. I'm gonna measure out a fourth a teaspoon. We went through all the tea swift Who should we listen to now? We can listen to my simp playlist. No. This one's the most underrated Taylor Swift song ever. Hannah Montana the movie. If you don't know this song, learn it. You're fake. Dash of cinnamon. Dash. One teaspoon of your honey. Dump it, dump it, dump it. Two teaspoons of water. Water from our stolen Brita. So now you need two teaspoons, especially if it's from a stolen Brita. One teaspoon of vanilla extract. Flatten this mixture on here. I just Ooh. don't understand why it's being baked on a baking sheet if it's like a bar. I don't ask questions. You just work here. I'm just the employee, dude. 350 for seven minutes. Ashley's my apprentice. She's my intern. You're interning for two important people right now. I'm double intern. Oh, we need to take this out. We need to take this out. We need to take this out. We need a bowl. <laughs> Four teaspoons of the sugar. Now we need cinnamon. Oh, the entire thing. Now we pop it back in for 10 to 15 minutes, and in the meantime, we're gonna craft the icing. Splash of vanilla. One and a half tablespoon of water. Cause I don't need Oh my god! <laughs> this is what happens when I measure with my heart. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. It's okay. <laughs> I don't know what came over me. I completely fumbled the bag on this. You're supposed to cut it in half and flip it on top of each other. And it's supposed to bake together like that. Can we do it now? We could. Yeah, let's do it. It has about three minutes left in there, but well, like, yeah, better late than never, I guess. Honestly, I agree. That's hot as balls, though. Oh, that was a solid rip. It's nice and clean, pretty pristine. Ooh. Dude, I'm dropping bars out here. Back in for like four more minutes. We can start on the oat burgers. Recipe six. Oat burgers. Oat burgers. Oh, I just saute an onion. I can do that. You can saute the onion. I'll do the easy work. I picked this one because it was my favorite. Half a cup of oats. One can of beans. I still... Oh, I got my film photos. I'm gonna take these out and then I'm gonna drizzle this icing that we made. We're on the... We're talking about the oat bars here, not the oat burgers. Now we're gonna... There's a chair. Back to the oat burgers. Do you want to mince the garlic too? We have minced garlic in a can. Two teaspoons. Paprika and cumin. I don't know if we have either of those, but we can do like similar spices. Both call for one teaspoon. We're gonna do garlic powder and chili powder. 21 seasoning salute. Salt and pepper. One teaspoon of baking powder. One egg. This is hot. I'm just sacrificing my working fingers. I'll no longer be able to leave fingerprints. You should commit a crime. Now's the time to commit the acts of arson. Uh, come along with us on our arson vlog. Day in the life of an arsonist. No one's gonna get that. No one's gonna think we're actually arsonists. 
You guys decide. <laughs> what are your next videos, right? Yeah, if you guys didn't know, I was planning a lot of come arson Fine. with me. Get ready with me for some arson. Arson supplies. Arson oh. makeup routine. <laughs> Cinnamon oat bars, ladies and gentlemen. We did also fuck up the recipe like seven different times. I cheers. Mean, cheers. <laughs> Mmm, that was good. This is some vanilla ice cream. I have almond milk ice cream. Do you wanna crack it out? Yeah. <laughs> Yay! 12 out of 10. This is fire. I would give up my second child if I could have this. Who's your first child going to? Ed Sheeran. <laughs> Daddy Ed. Well, wouldn't he be the father anyway? If I could get that far with that sexy man. Ed Sheeran, if you're watching this, I'd give you all my children. I'd have seven kids if it's they were It's an with open you. offer, bro. Come and get it. She's sexy. Saving yourself for Ed Sheeran. A guy approaches me. I'm sorry. I'm actually saving myself for Ed Sheeran. They're like, all right. You're crazy. Just kidding, guys. I'm in a very happy relationship right now, and I would give up Ed Sheeran for him. I would choose Nathan over Ed Sheeran. Seriously? I really would. Guys, I'm a simp. We have sauteed the onions. Oh my god. I'm gonna lose my sanity. You've been sitting here making oatmeal for like five hours, and you're just now saying that you think <laughs> that you are going to lose your mind? Did you hear that? Dude, something's alive in here. Here's the mixture and what it looks like. If you guys have ever seen Total Drama Island, it looks like what that chef makes. Now you basically just grill these on the stove top. I'm a certified burger chef. That was my job for a year. Do they look like burgers? No. That actually, dude, those look like burgers. Are you kidding me? What kind of burger? Here's the burger. Ooh. I put it on a non bread. Cheers. Cheers. That's so good. I fuck with the oat burger. I'm not gonna lie, the texture's a little weird, a little gooey. I think it's so good. 10 out of 10. Recipe number seven, chocolate orange oat cake. My mouth is on fire. Half a cup of rolled oats. Now we're gonna blend this into a flour. One and a half tablespoon of cocoa powder. One teaspoon of baking powder. Fourth of a teaspoon of salt. And now we stir three tablespoons of orange juice. I'm just gonna cut this orange and squeeze the juice out of it. Oh, I think I've cut my in various spots throughout this video, put in a tablespoon of maple syrup, a teaspoon of vanilla extract, a third of a cup of milk, stir that again, one teaspoon of orange zest, stir again, and then you put it in your greased ramekin, toss it in the oven at 350 for 20 to 25 minutes. Recipe 8, we gotta get grinding here, I'm overdoing this. Recipe 8, savory oats. Per Ashley's request, half a cup of rolled oats, and then one and a half cups of water. Two tablespoons of nutritional yeast, but we don't have that and it's like 10 bucks and I didn't want to buy it, you so we need to do that. Half a cup of mushrooms of your choice. Two cups of kale. I just eat these straight. Okay, I'm gonna just measure this with my heart. I'm just gonna do what feels right. I have to stop eating these mushrooms. Dude, the burgers. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I was low-key a bad burger chef. <laughs> Cook that all on the stove top. Medium heat for eight minutes. Our wonderful savory, savory oats. It just looks like risotto. Cheers. This just changed the game for me. Wait, dude, I'm gonna be making oats for every meal now. Sweet oats, savory oats. You already oats. do that, bro. Sriracha, grab the sriracha. It did say to top with sriracha. This would be good with like an egg. Hot sauce thing. Yeah. I like to feel pain. Drizzle that. 10 out of 10. Make this. Carrot cake oatmeal cups. Do you know how to grate a carrot with a knife? No, but I can try. One cup of milk of our choice. We choose almond. One egg. Question of the day, if you say egg or egg, there is a right answer. Do I say egg? No. I think I say egg. No, you say egg. Okay, good. Um, One fourth a cup of your choice of sweetener. Two cups of oats. Why would you not just buy grated carrots? I didn't see those. Do you still have the ones from the Springles? Yeah. I forgot about those. One teaspoon of baking She's powder. She's going to be doing a DIY carrot grating. Look at this. Look at this. I've made a shiv out of a carrot. A shiv? Do you want to? A like shiv? our friend a shiv? A shiv is a thing. It's an object. No, it's a person. Yes. What are you talking about? A shiv. One shim. teaspoon of cinnamon. And then it says a third of a cup of raisins. We're omitting Literally a shiv. And then it says one third of a cup of shredded coconut too, but unfortunately couldn't find those. I don't know if they exist. A third of a cup of chopped walnuts. Usually it's like prison slang for an improvised knife. Like, and why would you know that? Because you've been in prison. Ashley would have so much fun in prison. We've talked about this a lot. Actually. Yeah, actually, I think I would have a great time. This is besides the point. How much would you say one carrot is? Okay, so you want to know my idea on how to make these? We're gonna use these. Make a big one. No, I was gonna put tin foil and like 
That's a bad idea. I'm trying to think right now. Okay, because the way you're looking at me makes no. it a bad idea. Well, okay, what I'm thinking is that we just make a big one. Okay. 350, 30 to 35 minutes. We are on the 10th and final one. Crumble cookie oat remake. I've never had a crumble cookie before. Hopefully it is close. I don't know. A fourth of a cup of oats. One scoop of the protein powder. That just didn't happen. No one saw that occur. Half a teaspoon of the baking powder. Half a teaspoon of the cocoa powder. A tablespoon of maple syrup. A tablespoon of peanut butter. Then we're doing an egg. Red food coloring now. This shit dyes everything. Oh my gosh. Mixy mix. White chocolate chips. I'm unfortunately just not a fan of white chocolate, so I got semi-sweet dark chocolate. It's like a bar, but I'm gonna break it up into like chunks kind of. Go. I've gone through phases of up and down with this video of like I'm excited to make oats to like make this pain end to like <laughs> this is good to I just want this to stop to I think I'm numb to emotion at this point <laughs> eight minutes into the oven Top it with a chocolate sauce and a powdered sugar chocolate sauce. We could just melt chocolate melt chocolate all this spice dude I can't take this here's the so far nude chocolate cake She's beautiful. It looks so dense. Bro. Fire. Favorite thing. No, 100%. We this said the best. Bar on my scale before. No. No. The bar this. was on the floor. Oh. oh my god. It's so rich. And then it has a hint of orange. And it's like fresh and refreshing. Oh my, god. my birthday cake better be this cake. Wow. That is all I can say. Wow. wow. Who invented this recipe? I would like to give them a kiss. I would like to give them my will. No. Crumble cookie inspired cookie. This is what she looks like. I honestly was so burnt out at this point. I was like, I don't care if it doesn't look like a cookie. It's pretty massive though. Cheers. Cheers. Okay, like, it's pretty good, but this is better. It's hard to follow up. Yeah, it's just like hard to follow this. This is good. This is a solid, like, 7 out of 10. Dude, look at my shirt right now. <laughs> I give this like an 8 out of 10. It just followed up like the best act. It's like if Ed Sheeran goes on and Justin Bieber goes on right after. Like, that is just... That's a hard act to follow, man. I don't know. I have to take them out of an ASAP. Okay, the icing. Two tablespoons of the Greek yogurt. One teaspoon of vanilla extract. One to two tablespoons of the sweetener. I'm not kidding. I started off this video with 128 gigabytes. Clean SD card. I have like 20 minutes left on it. That's how much editing I'm going to have to do. I'm going to cry myself to sleep tonight. Cheers. Something's off, but I don't Why know Why is it what? sour? <laughs> Honestly, everything that followed up after this chocolate cake, failure. I give that like a six. I, I give her a five or a four. I, it's sour. Why is it sour? Anyways, moral of the story is this chocolate orange chocolate cake. cake deserves a Grammy. It deserves Ed Sheeran. I would do anything for this orange cake. Savory Sarah. oats, solid. Solid. The crumble cookie, fire. The cake pops were really oh, yeah. good. The cinnamon thing, that was really fire too, especially with the ice cream. I really like the oat burgers. Basically, I just really like anything that's made with oatmeal. Guys, this is a beautiful song to a beautiful ending of a video. Been making oats for over five hours now. I want to throw myself off a bridge. But I really hope you guys like this video. Any last words, Ashley? Oatmeal's great. That's the moral of the story. And yeah, bye video. If you guys like this video, make sure you get a like. If you really like me, don't forget to subscribe, comment anything you want down below, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, broskies! Bye. Now I'm running with you around these, let's sing. I got copyrighted, so enjoy this outro for now.